Thomas and Friends, episode 23, Rusty Blue Scrap Iron. Sir Handel was sitting at a siding at the yard. He was taking a nap. When he woke up, he saw Duke and Bertram. Suddenly, he heard his name from Duke. Sir Handel was suspicious of what Duke and Bertram were talking about, so he went over to see them. All right, Grandpa said Duke. All right, Grandpa said Sir Handel. What are you and Bertram talking about me for? Nothing that would interest you, Sir Handel said Duke. Oh, come on, said Sir Handel. I know you guys are caused trouble. What is it? Nothing, said Bertram. Well, have fun doing nothing. Can you please get out of our way, Sir Handel, said Duke. I'm not even blocking away, said Sir Handel. Whatever, said Duke. Come on, Bertram, let's go. And Duke puffed away. Bertram followed, but before he, when he went past Sir Handel, he said, Rusty blue scrap iron. Sir Handel was horrified. Rusty blue scrap iron. Rich cognate. Huh. Sir Handel puffed away. Peter Sam was about to take a train of stone to the Blue Mountain Quarry when Sir Handel found him. What got you so down, P Sir Handel, said Peter Sam. Peter Sam, earlier today I was talking to Grandpa and Bertram, but before they left me, Bertram called me Rusty Blue Scrap Iron. Hmm, said, Sir, said Peter Sam. Maybe you should play a trick on them to get them back. Of course, Peter Sam was joking, but Sir Handel didn't know it. But Sir Handel didn't know. You're right, Peter Sam said Sir Handel, and he puffed away. Wait, Sir Handel said Peter Sam, I wasn't being serious, but Sir Handel was gone. Huh, <sighs> I don't know what's gonna happen now. Sir Handel's plan was to shunt trucks onto the T-switch so Bertram and Duke would crash into them. Once he set them on the switch, he went back and, and went to watch the entire thing happen. Bertram and Duke were racing each other. When, ah, oh, stop, 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 stop. Ow. <laughs> I got you back, Grandpa. That's what you and Bertram deserve for calling me Rusty Blue Scrap Iron. You're responsible for all of this? Sir Handel, said Bertram. For shame. Rusty arrived with the breakdown train, along with Sir Topham Hat. Who caused this, said Sir Topham Hat. That blue tank engine over there, said Duke. Sir Handel gulped when he saw Sir Topham Hat. Sir Handel, I want you to come with me now. Rusty, pick up this mess. Yes, sir, said Rusty. Soon Rusty went to work.
Now Sir Handel said Sir Topham Hatt. Why did you make Bertram and Duke crash? Earlier today, sir, they called me Rusty Blue Scrap Iron. Peter Sam was joking that I should get them back by playing a trick on them, on them but I took it seriously and it now it got me into trouble. Well, since says Sir Tom Hat, Sir Handel, if Duke and Bertram are being mean to you, you need to tell me, and I could sort them out. Yes, sir, said Sir Handel. I'll learn ne better next time. That's a good engine, said Sir Tom Hat. Now please, get back to work. Yes, sir, said Sir Handel, and he puffed away quickly. So, the mess was cleaned up. And they, and the trucks were pushed back into the siding. Luckily, they weren't damaged at all. And as for Sir Topham Hat, Rusty took him back home. Some of you may be asking what happened to Bertram and Duke. Sir Tom had to shut them up in the shed for the day. I bet this would teach them a lesson never to call Sir Handel Rusty Blue Scrap Iron ever again.